Hello, this is Mr. Ahmed and today we'll do lesson 1.6 Use the Preka Part Strategy to Add And our essential question is How can you use the Preka Part Strategy to add 3 digit numbers? So, let's unlock the problem There are more zoos in Germany than in any other country At one time, there were 355 zoos in the United States and 414 zoos in Germany. How many zoos were there in the United States and Germany altogether? So here we will add the 355 and the 414. You can use the break apart strategy to find sums. Example 1, we will add the 355 plus the 414. So first, let's estimate the 355 plus the 414. The 300, it will be 300 or 400. Look at the digit to the right of it, which is 5. The 5 is one of the strong digits. So the 3 will be 400. And here... The 4, it will be 400 or 500. Look at the digit to the right of it, which is 1. 1 is one of the weak digits. So the 4 stays 400. So 400 plus 400 is 800. So our answer should be something close to 800. So step number 2, break apart the add-ins. Start with hundreds, then add each place value. So the 355, we will break it to 300, the 3 is at hundreds, so it's 300, the 5 is at tenths, so it's 50, the other 5 is at once, so we'll keep it 5, the 414, this 4 is at hundreds, so we'll make it 400s, and the 1 at tenths, so it's 10, and the 4 at once, so we keep it 4. And now we add the ones. 5 plus 4 is 9. 50 plus 10 is 60. And 300 plus 400 is 700. And we add the 9 plus 60 plus 700. So here in step 3, we will add the 3 numbers. 700 plus 60 plus 9. So 9 plus 60 is 69 and 700. So the answer is 769. So there were 769 zoos in the United States and Germany altogether. Let's have another example. Add 467 plus 208. Let's first estimate the 4 we keep it 400 or we make it 500 look at the digit to the right of it the 6 the 6 is one of the strong digits so the 4 becomes 500 the 2 we will make it 200 or 300 look at the digit to the right of it it's 0 0 is one of the weak digits so we'll make it 200 so 500 plus 200 is 700 so our answer should be close to 700. Okay, let's break apart the 467. The 4 is 400, the 6 is 60, and the 7 at once we keep it 7. The 2 at hundreds will make it 200, 0 at tens, and 8 at once. Now we add 7 plus 8 is 15, 60 plus 0 is 60, 400 plus 200 is 600. So we should add 600 plus 60 plus 15. 15 plus 60 is 75 and 600, so the answer is 675. Okay, now get the next page. Try this. Use the break apart strategy to find 343 plus 259. The estimate 
the three at hundreds beside it four four is weak so we gave it 300 and the two beside it is five five is one of the strong digits so the 200 becomes 300 300 plus 300 is 600 okay so let's break apart the 343 the 3 is at hundreds 300 the 4 at tens so 40 the 3 at ones so it's 3 here 259 let's break it apart the 2 at hundreds so make it 200 the 5 at tens so make it 50 and the 9 at ones we give it 9 now let's add 3 plus 9 is 12 40 plus 50 is 90 and 300 plus 200 is 500 okay so let's add all of these 500 90 and 12 0 plus 0 plus 2 is 2 0 plus 9 is 9 plus 1 is 10, write 0 and carry up 1, 1 plus 5 is 6, so our answer is 602. Here we have a question, explain why there is a 0 in the tenth place in the sum, why do we have 0 here? When you add the ones, you get 12 ones. You regroup the 12 ones as 1 10 and 2 ones. When you add the tens, you add 40 and 50 and the regroup the 10. So that gives you 100. 40 plus 50 is 90 plus 10 is 100. You can't write 100 at the tens place. So you regroup the 100 as 100 and zero tens which means you write a zero in the tens place okay here he asks how do you know your answer is reasonable i know that both add-ons rounded to 300 and 300 doubled is 600 that is our estimate at the beginning the answer is 602 is close to the estimate, which is 600. So if your answer is close to the estimate, then your answer is reasonable. Now, share and show. Complete. Here we are adding 425 plus 362 we round it to 400 and 400 so 400 plus 400 is 800 so let's complete this 425 4 at hundreds is 400 and 2 at tens is 20 plus the 5 here 3 at hundreds is 300 6 at tens is 60 and the 2 at ones is 2 so let's add 5 plus 2 is 7, 20 plus 60 is 80, and 400 plus 300 is 700. So we add 7 plus 80 plus 700, which is 787. So our answer is 787. Number 2. Write the numbers the break apart strategy shows. Here we have 130 and 4, and that was 134. We have 4 at ones, 3 at tens, and 1 at hundreds. Here 200s, 40, and 9. So it was 249. 2 at hundreds, 4 at tens, 9 at ones so if we add all of these 13 plus 70 plus 300 we will get our answer 13 plus 70 is 83 
3 plus 0 is 3, 1 plus 7 is 8, 300 plus 83 is 383. So 13 plus 70 is 83 plus 300 is 383. The next page. Estimate, then use the break apart strategy to find the sum. Here 142 plus 436. So let's estimate first. Okay, 142, the 1 is 100 or 200. Look at the 4, the 4 is weak, so we keep it 100 plus 436. The 4 is 400 or 500. Look at the 3. The 3 is weak, so we keep it 400. So 100 plus 400 is 500. So our estimate is 500. Let's use the break apart strategy. 142 will make it 100 plus 40 plus 2 and the 436 will make it 400 plus 30 plus 6. Now let's add 2 plus 6 is 8 40 plus 30 is 70 and 100 plus 400 is 500 so if we add 8 plus 70 is 78 plus 500 so we'll have 500 and 78 let's solve one more question here number six 654 plus 243 let's estimate the 6 is 600 or 700. Look at the digit to the right of it, which is 5. 5 is a strong digit. So the 6 becomes 700. Plus 243, the 2, we keep it 200 or make it 300. Look at the 4. The 4 is weak, so we keep it 200. 700 plus 200 is 900. So our estimate is... Nine hundreds. Okay, let's use the break apart strategy. Six hundred fifty four will make it six hundred plus fifty plus four. Two hundred forty three will make it two hundred plus forty plus three. Let's add four plus three is seven. Forty plus fifty is ninety. And 600 plus 200 is 800. So our answer is 7 plus 9 is 97 plus 800 is 897. Hope you guys understand the lesson. And if you are in my class, I'll check with you the on your own questions and the question that we left here from the sharing show on the live session. Have a nice day and goodbye.